All right, well, that's over. And now we get to launch Tugboat, okay? I'm not saying I'm playing this game for the story or anything, but I want to see Tugboat fly. I want to see him fly, mother! Hey, guys, welcome back to Plants vs. Zombies 3. In the last episode, we found Tugboat in the pool. He's sitting in Dave's chair. And it's not just a normal chair, okay? It's a rocket chair. So our job is to launch Tugboat in the chair. Okay, it's gonna cost three tickets to do it, so let's go play some Plants vs. Zombies, you know? Now, I, was, I mentioned in the last episode, guys, that it kind of feels like I'm gonna have to start using a few boosts now and then. I will if I have to, okay? Maybe I try a level first, see if I can beat it, and if something happens, then I will, uh... Wait a minute. Oh, snap. I know what's happening here. I know what's happening here, so forget everything else I was trying to say. This is like, um, it's not quite a last stand, is it? This is all the sun that we get for the whole for the whole level. Well, plus what falls from the sky, but we don't get any sunflowers. Let's speed it up. Wherever the first zombie comes, we'll go ahead and shoot him. Oh, you gonna go up there? Perfect. That's a great place for you to go. Uh, I guess just put you in the back. There's nothing else to go in the back. And we might as well just line these off. It seems like a reasonable thing to do. I mean, we gotta get through the cooldowns, right? I'm afraid to do this because I feel like a zombie's gonna come out as soon as I do. But he actually came out in the middle lane, so we're good. I'm sure this guy at the bottom can kill an imp. That's not a big deal. Well, here, you can just triple up, because I don't have anything to put in this lane where no zombies are actually coming anyway. Okay. Whoop, bonk. Figured I might as well finish that guy off. <laughs> Next up, level 44. Okay. Oh, wow. You know, I will say one thing, guys. I do like the way they set up these levels, you know, because uh, I feel like in PvZ2, they're usually not rearranged all that much. Like, I don't remember seeing any levels that have water in them like this. I think that's kind of a cool way to do things. Uh, let's go ahead and support this guy with the Bong Choy. We really don't actually need anything else in this game except Bong Choy's, I'm pretty sure. Okay, every day... I grow more sure of the fact that bong choy is the answer to every problem in life. Every single one, okay? Bro, what is with all the pigeons, man? Holy crap, bro! Can I do something about that or what? Goodness gravy! Oh, man. It's fine, I guess. But, like, bro. Bro, can you not? Like, does anybody need this many pigeons? No. These guys are like weasels from PvZ2, but not as bad. You know, nothing as bad as the weasels from PvZ2. I hate them so much. Or is it the chickens that I hate? I'm pretty sure it's both. 45. Let's go. Another level with a whole bunch of lily pads. And guess who's got bonk choys, baby? <laughs> oh no, the pigeons are here, folks. That could complicate things. It probably won't, but it could, you know? <laughs> oh my god. The birds. What's with the birds? Final wave? Yeah, really? Okay. Uh, I feel like they made one level in this game hard. There was one level, I think in the last episode, that I actually had to use a power up on to make it a little bit easier. And now, like, it's just back to, back to business as usual, back to bonk choy as usual. Thanks for playing. Thanks for losing. All right, well, that's over. And now we get to launch Tugboat, okay? I'm not saying I'm playing this game for the story or anything, but I want to see Tugboat fly. I want to see him fly, mother! It's a Game of Thrones reference, okay? I'm, uh, I'm reading I'm reading Game of Thrones right now. I want to I wanna see this man fly. Three, two, one, blast off! You gotta blast this guy off. Come on, let's go blast him off. Oh, oh. Bruh. Bruh. There he goes. There goes my hero. Looks like Team Rocket's blasting off again, folks. <laughs> it it kind of reminded me of, uh, you know, in uh, in Super Smash Brothers when you get that really good hit and they fly up and back down and wing. Same sort of deal. That's great. Haha, <laughs> that was awesome! We should make more zombies fly. On second thought, flying zombies sound horrible. Oh, well, she changed her mind pretty quick, didn't she? Look what those zog maggots did to my pool! The water was crystal clear when I left it, and look at those poor trees! They're all wilted in trouble gong, like they've been scorched by this dank nastiness. 
scorched by the stank nastiest. If you feel scorched by the stank nastiness of this video, hit the like button. This whole area is a biohazard. And look, more vote for Zomboss posters. What's up with that? Maybe he's competing in a beauty pageant? He's gonna need a serious makeover. Speaking of makeovers, let's clean up the lawn, get rid of those horrid posters, and plant some beautiful new trees, and just completely ignore what Dave says because he's not making any sense anyway, okay? So just don't worry about it. All right, 46, what's up? Looks the same. We got bok choy, and no further questions. Let's just say, if this game doesn't let me pick my plants, then I'm just gonna have to take advantage of what I have, which is a bok choy. Okay, so I've had to delete a couple of plants. Not that it really matters, but it's kind of sad when that happens, if you ask me. More sun, please. I don't have enough sun. Uh-oh. That's okay. That bong choy was too far ahead anyway. We couldn't we couldn't do the double up bong choy thing, so that was that was bad. Uh Oh. Spicy. We good? Of course we're good. What a stupid question. <laughs> oh wait. Somebody's getting punched a whole bunch. All right, it's over. Damn, bro. Okay, now we get to pick our trees, guys. We want these trees or these trees or these trees or maybe it doesn't even matter. Okay. In the shade of those lovely new trees, long hours of landscaping go by in a flash. Wow, we. I thought I was gonna have to pay a ticket for that, man. I mean, I totally could have. Maybe maybe pay three for tugboat. So. Wow, what a difference. Now we need to clean up all that disgusting slime in the pool. Cough, cough. Suggestion. Pickle. Trinkets, cough, cough, horsey pancake, bumper. Uh-oh. Mo has a problem, guys. He's got Movid-19. Chug, I think the Z-Fog has pickled Mo's motherboard. Sounds like his carbonum is shot, too. I knew something like this would happen eventually. Is there anything you can do to fix him? I could swap out the damage components, maybe even uh, bag of some upgrades while I'm at it. <laughs> What are we waiting for? Let's upgrade Mo. He'll be better than ever. He'll be so good at killing children. They're gonna mess with me in this one. I just know it. Well, they've already got it set up actually. So, so these ones right here, the point of these guys, I, I might as well pop this down while I'm at it. The point of these guys is to clump them up so you can hit them with the uh, with the squash or the pear, as I like to call it. Um, and then the other guys, the 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 frozen pea shooters. These guys slow the zombies down so they're clumped up. So it's the same deal in both, but I might as well just put down the uh, the walnuts while I can just to get them down because maybe we'll get a whole bunch of stuff and we will have to put down a walnut. And then I'll be like, oh no, cool down. So boom, got them all, we're good. Okay, so I gotta wait for this guy in the middle to get his friends over here. This one should be good about now. Boom. Wait for it. And boom. Got it. Like, what even is this? What even is this? Yeah, throw the grapes in. I totally needed those grapes. What a, what a grape help that was, thanks. I'm like half done this game. I think there's like 80 levels and I'm at level 40 something. What? What's gonna happen when it comes to plants? Like we only have like a half a dozen plants so far in this whole game and we're like halfway through it. We're halfway through the soft launch. I don't really know. Anyway, back to the action, guys. Level 48, here we go. Look, I don't trust these lily pads, okay? They're uh, they're quite small. I don't know if they'll really hold my weight. So let's just not use them, okay? Let's stick to what we know, which is obviously just bok choy, okay? Have you figured that out yet? I hope you figured that out by now. There's one concern at the bottom down here, but I can always get triple bok choys. That would, uh, that's, uh, that's always a strat, speed it up. Oh, oh, come on. That's a lot of birds, man. Bro, are you really gonna do this to me? Really? Whatever. Let's see how it plays out. I don't know. Can these birds even hurt me? You, you need like you need real friends. You know what I mean? Like you need you need real friends, not birds. There he goes. He's dead. And so are the birds. It's lunchtime. Wow, this is useless. I mean, I I get that they're power ups. Okay, I get that the like boost or whatever they are. I get that they were, because I don't, I don't want to use them. Just need to apply the zipple gear here, adjust the turbo wizard, and fasten the slime filter. There, that should do it. Ah, I feel like a million units of nanocurrency. Query, do I detect new internal modifications? A million units of nan- this guy feels like a million Satoshis. 
You know it, little buddy. I beefed up your filtration system and added a new slime-sucking hose attachment. You're welcome. Wow, Mo. You, you suck now. So, I thought you sucked the whole time, but you really suck now. All those welds will need some time to heal. We'd better park our bungus here for a while and run a few tests. Declaration, I will test my new functionality on this slimy pool. For taco tickets. For a taco ticket, you will. What? Oh! Ladies and gentlemen, we have a new plant. The Lightning Reed. Unleashes a chain lightning attack, damaging up to three zombies at once. Shocking. I think it's kind of funny, guys, because I was just talking about weasels and chickens, and the number one defense against the chickens is the lightning read, at least in my opinion, because you can, you can, they're, they're really weak and you can damage multiple at once. So maybe we're gonna get some uh, some pigeon dudes. I forget what that zombie is called, pigeon zombie or something, right? We're probably gonna get some of those and we're probably gonna zap the birds away. So that will be nice. If we don't get, okay, there he is. I was gonna say, if we don't get these guys, then something's wrong. Kind of like their new look. It's nice. Lightning read shock zombies in its lane or one lane over. Zap. I guess you guys can only do uh, one at a time. Lightning Raid's attack can even chain between multiple zombies when they group up. So they need to be within one lane, I guess. Wait, what? Oh, there we go. That's what I was looking for. Didn't seem like it was actually... There you go. Now it's definitely chain reacting. Let's get some more of these, okay? So they're, uh, they're an expensive plant. Hopefully they actually, uh, they're actually, you know, useful or something. We'll see. I mean, it is so far good on the, uh, on the birds, I gotta say. Yep. Zap those birds to death. Bird on a wire, baby. Bird on an electric wire. All right. Um, I guess just more of these guys or something. They can zap one lane over, so why bother putting anything in those lanes? We can't, unless we dig up some plants. I don't think that's the point here. There you go. Come on in, zombies. Come on over. See what happens. You're probably gonna die. Spoiler alert. That guy's getting pretty far. These guys aren't super strong. Um, okay, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not sure how this is gonna be, to be honest. Let's get some more of these in here. I think that might be nice. Look at all that zapping we gotta do, man, jeez. Better just keep going. Okay, we're, we're doing it. It's like, it's basically an area attack, right? Area attacks are good. We like those. Okay. All right. Nice birds you got there, buddy. Shame I had to zap them all to death. And now it's time to decontaminate the pool. The water looks fantastic, Mo. Great job. <sighs> Our pool parties used to be so much fun. Fun, query, what is fun? Mo, you don't know what fun is, bro? You don't know what fun is? That's so sad. It's like, what do you even enjoy doing? What makes your day better? Probably serving his uh, his master. Maybe we can add a fun chip in or a, a, a chingle bl blump or whatever Dave would call it. You know, one of those. Reducing zombies to their base organic components. And and also plants sometimes. Guess what I found at the bottom of the pool? All the parts I need for our fog vacuum Brobblegurk. Rest up while you can, little buddy. We'll be ready to take back Neighborville before you know it. Uh. Since we're resting anyway, can we, could we throw a pool party for Mo? He doesn't know what fun is. Isn't that messed up? Yeah, it's a graggle pool party. I could build some new toys and test Mo's new compressor in the process. Break out the inflatables. So we're gonna play three levels, five levels. And then we're gonna have a pool party. That makes sense. All right, I'll be right back. Here we go. Look at that chain reaction. You'll love to see it. Can you guys make me some more sun, by the way? That'd be nice. Yeah, one great thing about these guys is the fact that they, you know, can do the lane over. That's actually like a really nice thing. Come on, you gotta kill these guys fast so I can get their points. Yeah, that's the good stuff right there. Well, we should be able to get some money anyway from these zombies now, unless we're, we kill them too quick. We're pretty good at killing zombies now, you know? We got eight lightning reeds. Here, help help this one out. We want we want our points. There we go, good stuff. Okay, next level. I get to choose how many sunflowers I want. Oh, 
Uh, we don't get a Bang Choy this time, guys. So, I guess I'm just going all Lightning Reed instead. We got we got to use Lightning Reeds on these lanes anyway, right? Like, there's no other choice here. So, like, just just Lightning Reeds till the cows come home, okay? You better you better watch out, okay? Things are getting kind of crazy. Mo, I need help. Wait, what? What the hell just happened? What did Mo just do? Did that zombie get knocked back somehow? Is that like a second mode that he can like like the first time they hit him, he knocks him back instead of mowing the whole lot or what? That's all I can think. Cause I cause I'm pretty sure the zombie got knocked back. Looks like we might need a little something right here. I, I chose to zap, okay? I don't know why I chose to zap. Take him out, buddy. Take him out. There we go. Okay, more stuff, guys. It's lunch, it's lunch time again. Something like something like that. I have enough that I could do one of the things, but I might as well just get the five levels done and then do both at the same time. Whoa, now that's a level. Hmm. Looks like a, well, I was gonna say a normal level with extra steps, but not quite. The, the the we can't add any more lily pads. We have to protect the lily pads that we have. Luckily, we have Bonk Choi, so I think Bonk Choi in the on the front lily pad ought to do the trick here. And then uh, lightning reeds in the middle. That is the strat. That's what we're going for. Let's see if it works. And Bonk Choi will also protect all this stuff in the back, so that's nice. He's just so strong, man. So strong. There's our lightning boy. Oh, but he's gonna do something like that, eh? Well, here you go. Might as well put a Bonk Choi behind that too, right? Great way to take some stuff out. Bonk Choi's are really convenient with the birds. I mean, it's probably more convenient to use the lightning things when you can. Both of them put together though, it's a good time. Okay, one more and boom. Bob's your uncle. We got a, we got a full thing going on here, okay? Expertly crafted. You'll love to see it. Damn, that guy really got the grapes, man. That was, whew. Okay, level 53. That's a whole lot of open water, man. No bong choys this time. What am I gonna do with my bong choys, man? You know, I actually had some bok choy for dinner the other day, guys. Bok choy, not bong choy. Although I wanted to call it bong choy even when I said it then, okay? It's so hard to not say it now. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put a lot of reeds in the middle, right? And then, oh, what is he? Tell him to stop. Tell him to stop. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna put a lot in the middle, and I'm gonna rely on these guys to do most of the damage, and I'll protect my sunflowers when I can, okay? I feel like cooldown is gonna be the worst part of this now. Huge wave of zombies is coming. Oh, that could be bad. We'll do that, okay? And then they'll hit this, and then we'll get lots of points for it. Okay, that's looking good. We got our, uh, our nut moved up here, okay? Uh, yeah, let's get some more zapping going on. Never hurts. And we zap this one zombie and it hits the other zombies too. Yeah. Another sunflower. I gotta make it look nice, guys. Gotta make it nice and symmetrical. Okay. My hands are tied. Y'all love to see it. Yeah, I actually got a lot of points from that, guys. That's good for my score. Okay. Old Chumble Blurm is moving up in the world, I'll tell ya. Okay, if we do one more level. We will be able to have this pool party with the inflatable or whatever. I don't remember what they said, but we're gonna do it, okay? Uh, you know what would be cool about this? It'd be cool if the zombies actually followed in the water. Like, if they had some sort of, some sort of, uh, like, swimming zombie that couldn't leave the water, that'd be really awesome. That'd be a really cool addition to this game. But, no. This just, it's a pretty level, but it doesn't really matter that all this water is here i don't think just gonna do this okay you're gonna be so shocked at my strategy here you're gonna be like i can't believe this happened i can't believe matt would do that we were not warned in advance that he had such strategies i'm being sarcastic if you can't tell okay you should pretty pretty much always assume i'm being sarcastic there you go haters enjoy I am gonna add a little more to this one though, cause it might hurt, might not hurt to get the birds out of the way a little bit. So there you go. And, oh, gotta put this there and boom. My hands are tied, okay. It's kind of fun to watch guys. I'll give them that, okay. Yeah, boom. All right, 
Yeah! One thing I will say that this game needs, guys, and this is like only a me problem and like other YouTubers, I want high quality pictures of the plants so I can use them for thumbnails, so I can make better thumbnails, okay? And PVZ2 does great for it. You go on the, you go on the wiki and you go in the gallery and there's pictures everywhere, okay? And all the plants and all the ways. Oh, 55 is hard, guys. That's, that's cool. Uh, so let's go for inflatable lounger. It's the next task on the list. Okay. That is very nice. I'm not gonna lie. Don't care much for the flamingo. This is pretty cool, too. That is a, uh, definitely something Dave would make, but I love this. I love this sunflower. I want this in real life, okay? I want to float around on a sunflower. Yeah. Sell the merch. That lounger looks so inviting. I'd love to relax, but there's just so much more to do first. Observation, voluntary suspension in receptacle full of liquid equals fun. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, suspension, of, getting in the pool, that's right. It probably won't work too well for you because you are a robot. Just saying. I don't know if you're waterproof or not, okay? I dropped my phone in the bathtub a few weeks ago. It was fine. It was only in there for like five seconds, but I'm, I'm, I'm just, I'm happy, you know? Happy that I uh, didn't break my phone. Uh, okay, I like the pea shooter. But that one's got a puff shroom, man, that's crazy. We'll go over this one, because I want to match the pea and the uh, the sunflower, okay. Good job, Mo. Which one do you want? Better call dibs before Patrice does. Query, won't these inflatables become deflatables with my when my blades touch them? Well, yeah, and also, yeah, yeah, you're right. This pool party is gonna be awesome. We need to set up some poolside furniture to lounge around in. Make sure to leave some room for dancing. Did I ever tell you that I'm a five-time disco dance-off champion? Advisory, dancing is an inefficient use of energy. Maybe you're right, Mo, but it's fun. That's what pool parties are all about, remember? Statement, safety is important too. A sunshade to guard your outer layers from sunburn is advised. A new fence to protect our inner layers from zombies might not be a bad idea either. We got a bunch more stuff we got to do. We got a poolside furniture and all that good stuff. I just, I just want to try this hard level. I want to see what's going to happen here, okay? It's a hard level, so... So are you saying that I can't use the basic bonk choice strat that I've been using this entire time? Because I'm gonna try and do it, okay. And there will be some reads in there too, don't worry. Okay, so this might be a challenge because of the fact that I don't have enough money to get all my bonk choice, but I'm getting there pretty quick, I'll tell you that much. There we go. Uh, I should probably have protected that lily pad over here. Because it's good to have lily pads. There we go. Now we get the reeds in here as well, of course. And that that can actually that actually works. Like it will it will zap to the outer lane, which is really nice. I mean, it makes sense, but yeah. So even if these guys can't reach all the stuff, if they can reach one zombie, it's good enough. Yeah. So this is a hard level, guys. So uh, just don't be surprised if I die during this level. Don't be surprised if the zombies eat my brains, guys. Cause this is a hard level. Okay. That gargantuar might be an issue, to be honest. We might have to bring up his rear, you know what I mean? There you go. Just a little more bonk for the joy, my dude. I don't even know why I'm bothering here. You can do the- just- just enjoy Mo, okay? Get on over there, you goofy looking dude. He's so goofy looking, man. Like, what's the deal with that? He just mowed. He just- I- I- okay. I swear he knocked the zombie back before. So please tell me if I'm going crazy or not in the comments, because I can't, I can't rewind reality. Yeah, I could look at my recording, but like I'm in the middle of it right now. Okay. Okay. Well, guys, we will end it here. Got a new plant today. The lightning reed. It's fun. I like it. I like zapping the birds. Okay. You add, you, you add an enemy that has a whole bunch of different parts to it. You're probably going to want to, uh, you know, lightning reed to go with it. And we got it. So, so, so we're happy. Yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed, please hit the like button and you can click right here to watch another one of my videos. This feels weird now because there's like stuff in the background, you know, just, just, just click it. It's all good. Just ignore everything else and click on the video. Thank you.